Hey guys, welcome to this week's Tip Tuesday. It is still lip week here on my channel, so today, you guessed it, we're gonna talk about the lips. We're gonna talk about exfoliating them into perfection so that you can apply your favorite matte lipstick or whatever lipstick and not have any of that dead skin. Getting in the way, junking things up. We've all been there a time or two when you look in the mirror and you're like, oh my, I need some chapstick or what is going on there? And just so you know, you can keep applying chapstick and balms and whatnot, but if you don't fix the problem of getting the dead skin off of your lips, it's just not gonna help. You're just gonna have hydrated, chapped, lips. So what I like to do before I wear any of my favorite matte lipsticks especially is do a scrub. Now you can go and spend $30 and buy one at the store pre-made, that is an option, but something that I really enjoy doing is making my own and I don't have to make a full jar of it. I don't have to measure out any olive oil or honey and put in the brown sugar and this and that. It's not complicated at all you will be blown away so what i like to do is take my favorite balm and at the moment i'm really into this bite beauty lip mask it's super intense and fabulous i love it but you could even use vaseline you could use aquaphor is a good option just any balm and what we're gonna do i'm actually gonna show you so i'm gonna take my lipstick off you want to do this obviously with no makeup on your lips so if you do this in the evening do it after you remove your makeup Lipstick is gone. Now I'm just going to take a little dot of my lip mask. Really, this is all you need, a teeny tiny, tiny amount. And then I am going to dip my finger, it's really complicated stuff guys, in a bowl of sugar. I actually like keeping sugar in my medicine cabinet in a small jar because I do tend to mix it up with oils and whatnot for body treatments or skin treatments. Sugar is a great, um, great thing to have on hand for exfoliation purposes in the bathroom. So anyway, I take my little finger with a little balm on it and I get a bunch of sugar um, stuck to that balm. Then I'm just going to massage this on my lips. You can kind of smack your lips together too. Hmm. And then what you would do is just take a washcloth and wipe your lips clean. If it's nighttime, put on some more balm overnight. I recommend doing that nightly anyway. And for daytime, you just could go straight into your lipstick application. Everything will go on very smooth because all of that dead skin is removed. And this is just a more intensive way to exfoliate your lips. You can still do the shortcut way of applying a balm and then rubbing your lips with a washcloth. That is one of my kind of quicker ways to exfoliate. But if I really find that my lips need to be treated and pampered and cared for and that dead skin needs to get out of here, this is what I like to do. And then there's just nothing to clean up. There's nothing to store, nothing's gonna expire and it's so simple. All right, so that is it for this week's Tip Tuesday. I hope you enjoyed it. Give this video a thumbs up if you did, and make sure you hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed, and thanks for hanging out. I will see you guys next time. Mwah.